Each week, American History TV's Real America brings you archival films that help provide context to today's public affairs issues. Crowded Out is a 1958 National Education Association film which addresses the problem of overcrowded schools as a result of the post-World War II baby boom. The program begins with a frustrated teacher writing her resignation letter, then shows how her once happy classroom gradually becomes dysfunctional and argues that overcrowded classrooms are incompatible with good education practices. This was the classroom, 24 pupils, with time for each child. Time to know and understand each boy and girl, to handle and guide them in different ways, along new paths, feeling her worth as a teacher. This was how it was until... the construction of the huge industrial plant that triggered the community to new life. Suddenly, almost overnight, the quiet suburb became a small city. Just as the community changed, so did the classroom. One by one, the class projects were removed to make room for more desks. More and more as the months went by. You see a classroom in a corridor, another in a basement. You see a classroom being set up on the auditorium stage. The school library taken out of circulation. Classes doubled up. You see a class operating in a nearby Quonset hut. A playground area designed for the safety of less than half this number. You attend the next meeting of the school board. There you sit among vacant chairs of those who, in the long run, frame school policies, who are responsible for our schools. The school board and the superintendent try to meet the problems of overcrowding. As they strive for solutions, you begin to wonder, whose fault is it that Kathy is not getting the best in education? Miss Roberts? Suddenly you feel a desire to help, to try to work out these problems with your neighbors through your community organizations. Also, because essentially you are a fair person, you begin to feel a sense of guilt about Miss Roberts. Guilt that grows, especially the next day when you hear from another teacher that Miss Roberts intends to resign. 